you gotta get your chicken in. You gotta get your chicken in, bro. You gotta get your protein. I can't be out here playing paintball if I, if I ain't fueled, you know what I'm saying? Where does I gotta get my, I, they're always late, bro. Sriracha, bro. Sriracha. You gotta have hot sauce on your chicken because ain't nobody trying to eat chicken without sriracha. You gotta have your Gatorade. Listen, personal secret, I put half Gatorade, half water. Today's episode three. Today's the third day of the journey. We're taking the boys on a post-tournament review. We're gonna go over what they did bad, what they did good. They just played their first tournament. Yeah, I know they probably think I'm a dick. I threw them into the ringer. Bear, you piece of <laughs> Just throwing us under, like, <laughs> You know, their first tournament, their second time ever playing paintball, I make them play a tournament. But you gotta get experience. Ain't nobody out here, you know, cooking filet mignon if they ain't never done a barbecue in their backyard. You know what I'm saying? You gotta get experience if you wanna be a champion. So today we're gonna try to make them champions. But it's one day at a time, so it's not gonna happen overnight. So I told them, listen, we gotta get back on the field, we gotta train. So we're here at Hollywood Sports Park. We're gonna kinda go over what they did wrong on the field and what they did wrong off the field. Because when you're playing paintball, you gotta make game plans. You gotta go over things. So Chance thinks it's okay to almost win a game and then decides to just throw his pack. He thinks he's playing football or something. I don't know what he was throwing, but he rips off his pack in the middle of the game. I'm like, no, what are you doing? I thought he was gonna start undressing. I thought he was in a fitting room. He rips off his harness. I'm like, I don't know what's going through his mind. The harness falls on the floor. He's still going. I'm like, is he dead? Is he alive? Is he still playing? No one could figure out what was going on. The sidelines is all freaking out. And then next thing you know, the dude comes through and shoots him three times in the back. I'm like, shit. I was like, someone gotta tell Chance. You can't be doing all that. What's wrong with you? Christian already has a little bit of experience. Out of the three, Chance and Anthony have never played. Christian has some experience. So I'm looking at Christian thinking he's ready to win the whole game. He's rapping. I thought he was gonna shoot everyone. Next thing I know, he gets his wig split. Whack! Gets shot in the face. I'm like, Christian, no! No, God! No, God, please, no! And, and, you know, I was gonna get mad, but I know Christian's playing with newcomers and they're in their first tournament, so I didn't want to say much. But in all reality, he messed up. He, he knows what he did. Anthony, not only, okay, here's the problem with Anthony. I'm gonna lay it down, I love the man. But he thinks because he's a model that no one's gonna shoot him off the brain. Anthony, they all shooting at you. I'm like, stop it. You're out here telling everyone that they suck. Like all these, these kids, bro, they ain't got game, son. Your confidence is at an all time high. We're pretty <laughs> good. Of course they wanna shoot you, bro. Are you crazy? So I'm looking at him, I'm like, yo, where do you wanna go off the break? He says, I'm going to the corner. I said, I don't know if that's really ready. I don't think you're ready for that. I go, well, we need to work on your running and shooting and your sliding. And he didn't wanna do those drills at practice. So I'm like, okay, well now we're gonna see if you really need him or not. Three, two, one, he's running full speed, looking like Usain Bolt. I never seen speed like this before. Ha, <sighs> ha, <sighs> whack. Dies off the break. I go, are you kidding me? Anthony, are you kidding me? Walks off the field like nothing happened. I go, bro, what's wrong with you? It looks like he just took a shower, clean shaven, nice and fresh. I go, bro, not even a drop of sweat. He goes, I gave it everything I have. I go, you gave it nothing. You gave it absolutely nothing. The boys played great though for the first tournament. Super, super proud of them. But now it's time to take it to the next level and that's what this is all about. Let the journey begin. I know you've been talking about how we're late. <laughs> I know you've been talking about how we're late. Have you been talking shit? Have you been talking about how we're late? Oh, so the boys yeah, decided to show up today. Yo, guys, guys, look, the traffic, I live in Hollywood, all right? Traffic, Only traffic's a pain. Landon's getting new tattoos. Oh, Christian what? was conditioning his hair. Chance was doing cardio. Let's see if these are brittle. The, boy, the boys decided to finally show up. But listen, oh, he shit, did show up, so you know we gotta reward him properly. Hey! You know we gotta reward him properly. We gotta Crazy! Jersey. My we gotta boy! His jersey. Hell yeah! Yo, I didn't think hey, you were coming. Jordan, we pulled in right style. behind you. Yo, it's not my fault these two didn't eat before we came. I was sitting here eating protein chicken the whole time, watching my cuts while you guys are at Carl's Jr. eating a fish fillet. Uh, I needed some Jesus. Jesus. I'm trying to see if these are brittle or not. 
Right. They're good to go. Too many bricks. <laughs> He's been sitting in the back of my car. We're running days. drills. Anything's good, boys. Look at this whip, ready to rock. Yo, shout out to Empire for the Yo, new Empire, whip. what's good, fam? <laughs> We're GT fam too, yeah. so we need fa fam hookups, dog. I'm sending. I'm sending yeah. guns. Oh, chicken! Ahead, play wow, with it. brand new. Yeah, I, I, haven't, I haven't washed my jersey yet. Once. About time you turned into a paintball player. Listen, you don't wash your gear. Everyone knows that. You let your battle wounds, you know, just sweat. continuously run on with you throughout Steamy the season. Steamy heat. No, this man bought forward. eight guns. He has eight gun setups. This What's wrong with him? This thing's about to shoot. Use this one over that one. You need a yeah, true life this is way better. Uh, episode, my G. What? You need a true life Yeah, episode. I know. I'm Jesus. addicted to paper. Reverse He's threaded. Chill, chill. Watch the documentary that chicken starts off this small. They inject it with water. It blows up this big. That's fake meat. You're eating a half dog, Landon, half pineapple. Landon, what are you doing to me? What? Everybody Landon knows, recommended this. Everybody knows the fast food. That has more sodium and GMOs than half of the cornfields in Minnesota. That's a lot. <laughs> I'm kidding, bro. I'll take a Eat the sandwich. Like that. What? that actually, to I'm going to tell you something right now. Oh, and there's pineapple in it? Oh, that's disgusting. That's good for you, pineapple. That's disgusting. Look at this. I brought you a whole chicken boy, oh, like no, a gentleman. <laughs> Eat the rabbit food, bro. I feel I'm better about vegan myself. during the week, so I find the mint chip ice cream. Try it? Yeah, try it. <laughs> All right, my level hopper is ready to go. Yo, um, as long as this works, I can do anything I need. Yo, hot, can you can you get batteries in my my uh, hopper? Oh my yeah. god! I don't, know, I don't know how to do that. I got here. Got hooked up. I'll it. Am I your personal oh. battery man? No, we gotta no. teach you how to do this. Let me put it up on YouTube. So you slide in there. These two notches go in, uh -huh. right? Yeah. This piece on the back is clicked in. That's underneath. Oh. Yeah, I got the speed feed ready. All right, so speed feed. You should just click right in if you just do it like that. They should just go right in. Let me help you out. Okay, I gotta learn. Okay, I gotta learn. You change the batteries. So you do that, bro. He can't be calling up Chili. Yo, how do I change the batteries, bro? I just make a video and tell him go look at it. It goes in, so you slap it in and you let it go. So try it like that better. Missing oh two. my god. Why well, I don't use this hopper? This is why I use the number one hopper in the game. The level hopper, as you can see, is very nice, very sturdy, very durable. That one. That one. Dude, good, I right? want one. I DM them to follow me. There you go. If you, I DM'd Empire to follow there you go, me. They follow there you, go. you, bro. If it pops off, why you trying to do it? I didn't know that. Oh, that's why Christian just Basic running and shooting, we're gonna do after. We're gonna start with just snap shooting to go over it again, especially so everyone can fine tune. It's always good to run the drills. We're gonna come here, it's a 15 second drill. I'll be having a clock, you're gonna keep doing it till time's over. Come out with your elbow in, snap the cone, switch hands by keeping your gun up. When you come on this side, just move your hip, snap the cone, switch hands, you have to take one knee, snap out, switch hands, take one knee, snap out. It's four sides. Oh, one good. shot, or or shot a little burst? One shot, one pull. Quick. One cone and one cone. Quick. It's all about quick and accuracy. You don't hit the cone, do you just move on? Or no? Don't hit the cone, you keep moving on. And we're going to keep running it. And I'm going to do it on time. Where you and just finesse. Just, what? Going? just the you, line going. When you going. finish the four, do you take off shooting it? Or no, what? you finish the four, walk to the back of the line, like knockout. Goggles on, guns on, let's get this popping. First drill, sudden death elimination snap out drill. Let's get it popping. My scout. 15 second increments. Snap high, snap high, snap low, snap low. Run through it a few times, and then once you start missing, you get kicked out of the line. But that's shooting from that bro. Look at Landon can start. All right, Landon, start us off. <laughs> Wait, so it's right, switch, left, and then down, and yep. then down this way? Perfect. Okay. Right now, worry about accuracy in the movement. Don't worry about speed. Okay, we're just... Are we going? Go. I'll go right when you take your first shot. Nice. Remember, just like Christian, when he switches hands, remember guys, we're not dropping that gun. Your gun comes from here, switch hands immediately into this hand. Yep, just like that. All right, go. Remember, when we come low, we're still coming low, we're snapping out. Snap out. 
look at look at your feet. This leg's way back here, so you're a little off balance. Yeah. Scoot it in a little bit. Should be nice and even. Look at my feet. So I'm just using my hips. I'm coming out. All right, there you go. It's all right. Nice. Oh, I see. Yeah. I see. Trying to, you're trying to shoot it too fast. So just slow down, wait for the jump go. You don't shoot one of the four times you're out. Extend, boom. So you're like right behind him, you know? Yeah. Instead of shooting the gun at an angle. Cool. All right, he's out. Next. All right, here we go. Nice. 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 All right, next. Okay, so listen, when everyone comes low, let me see your gun. When everyone's coming low, instead of utilizing the time you're given, you're kind of just shooting like this at an angle. So realistically, you're shooting the Dorito. Real, the gun should be nice and tight behind you, and when you come out, the gun should be ready to shoot, and it should be straight shot. So you're not coming at a slant, because you're snap shooting. You're coming out, you're putting it on him, you're coming back in. It's a quick snap, and it's quick back in. You're gonna need that, because now you're shooting back at someone. We just finished snap shooting, uh, and it needs work, I need work. Um, left side's gotta get a lot better. Um, boys are doing good. Got a G, one G and 17 losses. So I think I'd advanced a little bit today. But yeah, need, needs needs work. We need work. I need work. First drill, yo, snap shooting. That shit's lit. Uh, I guess Barry just said it's about patience and finding the shot. Don't just come out shooting and like come out tight and like if I come in, find him and then come out, I know where he's at. Uh, I think that's something to practice. I think that's like free throws and everything else. Like you just, and like simple shit, you have to practice every single day. Like you just can't not practice that. What the what? Stand up, stand up. Right now, you're only gonna be able to play off the right side for the first round. After that, we're gonna do 10 seconds, get everyone warmed up, then you'll be able to play both sides. Okay, ready? 10. Go. Snap out, battle. What? Battle, come oh, out. Okay. So what I want you to do, if you win the lane, so if I come out and snap, I win it, I'm not gonna come back in, right? If I win the lane, I'm then gonna hold it, and I'm gonna wait for him. And, it's still one and he's gonna come right out into one of my balls. And then what I can do is, after I'm winning this lane, I can change heights, but I'm never gonna go back in. But the one thing you can do is you can kind of bait him. Put a few, and then switch sides, but instead of shooting this side of the bunker, I'm still shooting this side, so I'm waiting and you expose yourself, but it's a good technique sometimes when you're battling. So you guys can try that too. Don't worry about getting shot. Who wants this? 10 seconds, game's up. <laughs> Loser stays off, stay on. <laughs> they yeah. fear me.
Charles Taylor. I've been working at Hollywood Sports for nine years. I love paintball because of the people. The environment is a good environment. I love to help kids out here and there, you know. It's a family. It's another family outside where I grew up at. This is a family. They pretty. I think they're pretty good. They only been playing for about maybe what less than a month, maybe, and they played their first tournament. And they did kind of good. What do you think of their snap shooting though? The uh, snap shooting is it's uh, there. It's you gotta there. be honest with me. It's there. They they getting there, man. They do it better than some of the people that have been playing for a long for about five or six years. For them to just come in and play their first tournament and do that good, I really respect them for that. I like that. The chance Anthony and Christian, um, I think they're the definition of the sport. Uh, just their enthusiasm alone coming into it and, and just going, you know, all hands in and uh, making it happen for themselves. Um, they learn by their mistakes and that's how this, this sport is, is made. Their enthusiasm and making it grow and making it happen. So I think uh, they're going to definitely blow this thing up out of the water. Go over some stuff with you. Like that, that was good. I want to brush up on your running and sliding into the corner. We're going to do that right now. Bro, you literally were running and sliding. It looked like a rhinoceros and a hippopotamus got into a fight at the WWE SmackDown. Like you just guys ran into each other and like, like Anthony too, he runns into the ground. You see the photos? Yeah, Paintballs no, flying everywhere. I'm, Hoppers I'm flying like, off the gun. I'm like, like this bang up. Bro, literally, he just, it's like a crash landing. It's just do 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 poof. And it's just dirt everywhere. Realistically, in snapping with you, everything else was golden. Just keeping the gun straight, ex not exposing your goggle, and then not having okay. the gun like in your face, holding it tight. And when you come out snapping, like all the way, you know? Because you can literally just. I mean, Christian's like good, but like you literally could put him in the dirt. I'm telling you, I wear number two for a reason, bro. We out here. So yeah, so we'll work on we'll work on your sliding too, so you're not. Yeah, dude, landing. my knees destroy because they just all boom. Did you icy hot those bad boys? Dude, I ice them. I I honestly didn't do anything to them. I just kind of ate the pain. All right, cool. Let me just show you guys real quick before we start. We're gonna do a simple, we're gonna, without shooting, the first round, you're gonna still hold your gun, still have your goggles on. Don't worry about shooting, just sliding into the corner. Quick technique. Basically, I'm gonna just teach you guys, you're gonna, I'll show you right here. If I'm sliding to this corner, if that's the corner, no matter how we're running, just worry about sliding. So if I'm running to this corner, whether I'm shooting or I'm like this, <laughs> the minute I start approaching the corner, I'm gonna put my gun down, lower my momentum, use my hand as the brace, and whip my feet underneath my body so my gun stays up. So I'm like this, boom, come right back up. So the hand falls, knee slide, gun stay up. <coughs> so we'll run it right here so we can just get a good glimpse. Goggles on, you're gonna stand right here. You're gonna, three, two, one. You're gonna come here, hand down, feet up, right back up. So it's 10, go. And then it's run, 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 and it's, Nice. Oh my, oh I can't go left. Why? Because I, my wrist is broken from sliding on it. Does it hurt? Yeah, I can't even lift weights on it, dead ass. Okay. Just run right now, let's just work on shooting. Nice, okay, so the reason you fell over is you just, you fell on your slide. Everyone does that, it's not a big deal. You want to swing your momentum. As I'm here, I swing my momentum. My hips come out from underneath me. When that happens, your feet take the impact your hand braces you, you can come right back up. All right, ready? Wait, so. Oh, oh. No, I want to redo that. Go. Nice. Beautiful, Christian. Yep. Now use your hand. When you put your feet first, that's how you hurt your knees. So use the hand to hit your brace. So your elbow, your arm, your shoulder takes the brace. Don't just stiff it out there. Make sure your elbow's a little bit bent so you don't pop your shoulder. You bend it, it takes the impact, your feet then hit the floor. You never hurt your knees. Stop. Ow! Okay, we'll stop doing it. Beautiful. 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 Okay, check this out. I'm gonna put a cone. You're gonna run and shoot the cone. As you run and shoot the cone, you're still sliding into the corner. The cone's gonna be about 30 feet away from you. Don't worry about hitting the cone in the beginning. Just worry about the form, worry about your speed, your momentum. Don't worry about the shooting aspect. But I wanna show you guys, when you're shooting, it's a little bit difficult. And then we'll run through this, and then we'll worry about form, we'll worry about accuracy. Let's just run through it so you guys get the, the, the point of it. Here. 
Yeah. It will help you for me not going like this. Okay. Beautiful, dude. Really good. Really, really good. Do it again. Get ready. Go. You're coming in. You're coming in. You're coming in. Gun out. Hand out. Boom. Right back in. Ow. Dude. What's wrong? What's wrong? I don't know, bro. I'm just That's all. It's okay. Listen. You, you got to put your hand down. Yeah. So what happens? You're sliding like this. Your hand's not helping you. Let your hand be your brace. Boom. Boom. Okay? Utilize that hand, baby. God gave you that hand for a reason. Nice. Keep going. All the way. Keep going. All the way to the three. Beautiful. Hell yeah. Hell yeah, dude. That's so good. That's so good. Yeah, that's so good though. When you're in the snake, especially for landing, because he plays the snake. So say you're running and shooting the whole way. If I'm gonna Superman slide into the snake, the minute I get in, my gun's up. Mm -hmm. I slide in, right? Yeah. Gun's up, I look. If no one's shooting, I'm right into the next one, crawling with my dick to the floor. I look. And I try to go into the next one again. Never wait. Okay. Get as far down it as you can. Okay. Sliding drill, my wrist, the outside of my left wrist is messed up, so I went the other way. Even with that said, my sliding sucks ass. Uh, so like the first couple of times it was just awkward. Like I've never slid like that. I would never need to in any other aspect of my life. But uh, I just started, like you could see on the quick replay, um, I was just getting the form down, just putting my hand down and swinging my legs around, coming up and just doing that again, just so it feels more natural. That actually helped a lot. Now I feel like I could slide a lot better. Straight so up. we're gonna do, we'll, we'll load back up and we'll go do two on twos. How you holding up? I'm fucking killing shit. Are you ready? Oh, I'm ready, bro. I'm just wired right now. We're not about to lose a single point in these lines, the points that we're running. We're not losing a single one. You were standing up. You would have been able to blast me. I didn't even know you were an snake because I saw you standing up. Uh, yeah, guys, doing shots of Derek. Shots of Hollywood Sports. We're out here playing uh, paintball. You know how we do it out here. These guys are pretty good. And the last two games are pretty tough, but we still managed to pull through. The first game, the second game was they got us. The second game, but other than that, shout out to Chance. Shout out to Team Ten. You know we're still out here. GT fan for life. Because you don't know what's going on on the other side of the field yet. Okay. So you should have stayed on me and watched me and just wait for me to make the move because the guy so close in front of you is gonna run you down anyways. Yeah. So maybe you could have shot me and then made it a one-on-one. -on -one. Okay. But either way, yeah. you were kind of in a screwed position. Nah, I'm gonna get a yeah, so he was battling with me. I go, I'm gonna wait for him. I was shooting one ball at a time. 
and he just gave me a little bit too much and I stuck in a ball. And then Chance was going crazy with me. But I already know this guy, he's wild, he's <laughs> rambunctious, he's gonna come run me down. So what do I do, I get low, I play on the outside of my bunker. I know he's gonna run on the inside, because I taught the kid, so I just go on the outside of the field, he comes running right on the inside and gets blasted. Never even makes it to me. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, I thought it was, I didn't know you were alive, I thought it was a one on two with me, so I just kinda said, no. all right. You had no, I saw you take off down the field and I was like, what? I didn't know the best thing that I've learned over the years is just crossing up one side, one guy gets inside, one guy gets outside, and you just hold them from advancing the field, but everybody did good. Um, again, need work, man. If we're gonna go pro, we need freaking work, dog. Uh, what's this video called? Action. What's this video called? Action. What's the video called? Okay. <laughs> All right, you're watching. What's the title? The title. What's the, what do you mean? Yeah, you're gonna be oh. a dad. Uh, that wraps the up recap. episode three of the journey. The recap. Okay, the recap. I guess, I don't know. Okay. No, episode three of the journey. Yeah, episode yeah, three of the journey. So I wanna know right. which one it was. Yeah. Ready. Action, action. Well, that wraps up episode three of the journey, what ladies what? and gentlemen. Running points. We got our skills getting better, getting you know, better. working on it. But finesse. Slowly. Finesse. Slowly. Finesse. Ain't no lion eating another lion fast. He gets a lion slowly. Yo, we're on the way to the goal, which is if you guys are new here, new to the journey, you still don't really know what the journey is, we're taking beginner to minimal experienced paintball players. Bro, they played us. three times. This is episode three. This yeah. is their third time playing. Their second time ever playing, they were in a tournament. Fourth the goal, place. The goal is to take us from nothing to pro and win an event. And that's the, that's what we're doing out here. We're finessing, we're fine tuning, we're grinding, we're doing a little mix, max, and Mitch. Next thing you know, it's a marinara nation. We fine-tuned, we worked on what we needed to. The boys played a tournament last episode, if you guys were watching. Today we went over a little bit of what we need to work on, and then we're getting ready, because we gotta practice on the next episode. Of the, I can't even tell you guys what's actually no, no, happening. So episode four, make sure you guys subscribe, make sure you guys do the full experience. One sec, let's go off screen. Let's go off screen, let's just show you guys what happened today. Bada bing, bada boom. This is what happens when you eat salad and you get it tossed. This is what happens, ladies and gentlemen. Watch your neck out here. This isn't a game, this is the journey. We going pro! Okay. Ah!